Cosby any comments, sir? Bill Cosby is now officially known as inmate NN7687. The disgraced comedian spent his first night in jail last night after being handed a three to ten year prison sentence in the drugging and sexual assault of Toronto native Andrea Constand. And the moment 81-year-old Cosby was led away from a Pennsylvania courtroom in handcuffs yesterday is being seen as one of the strongest visual moments of the Me Too era, a cultural reckoning playing out before our eyes. That would be the ideal for me, that this is the first case and that that effect will trickle down. And not mm -hmm. just for other powerful men in media or powerful men in entertainment, but in general, that this will be the trickle-down effect. Flair's contributing editor Stacey Lee Kong joined Melanie Ng and Roger Peterson on Breakfast Television this morning to discuss the powerful moment and what it means for this ongoing cultural shift. For all of the people who have been victimized, this feels like a symbolic victory because A, so often the justice system has not come through for us, and B, as we think about how Me Too is going to evolve as a movement, the justice system has to be part of that. I think that's why when we're talking about a sentencing of three to ten years, it does feel like a good surprise and, mm -hmm. and a symbolic victory, but that also feels a little bit light. There was the conviction. That's a good point. Right? Is that not... That's what everybody wanted. And yes. No matter what happens with the appeals process, you got the conviction, and that's the big thing. I think that is a big thing, but I also think now we want more, because if we're just saying, well, he, you know, he's admitted to certain things and he was convicted, but he didn't face any real consequences, then I think that is a loss of momentum. Cosby's sentencing is being seen as a move for Me Too from a hashtag revolution towards justice. Andrew Constant's case, it kind of is representative of not just the 40 women who have come forward uh, with allegations, but also probably the women who haven't come forward uh, with allegations against Bill Cosby. And in a sort of a, a looser way, all of the women who have come forward, period, mm -hmm. you know, in the, in the past year or so. For City News, I'm Terry Hart.